Hello, my darlings. Happy bloody Wednesday to you. I'm finally back. I was having internet troubles and tech issues and just everything that could go wrong with a job like this. It decided to go wrong within a week, which is which is great, which is great. Loved it. Had a lovely time. I hate tech issues. I really can't bear them. Really can't, but we're back. Hello. Welcome to Let's Build the world and welcome to the first part of the pancake house we are going to be doing bob eliza and their daughter i've made i've given them a daughter i've gave them a backstory we're in another area of willow creek today you beautiful beings so yeah we're gonna do we're gonna build something like this something semi new looking still got a new orleans vibe to it with the kind of um verandered kind of balcony areas that it's got but i do want it to feel a little bit more newer even though it's not i do want it to look like it's been kind of renovated over time you know um so that is the bloody mantra for today darlings it really is i'm gonna be back live on twitch tonight as well i'm gonna be looking through your builds this would be the first time that i'm looking through your builds off oh um on camera sorry i've had a look through at some of your builds and you guys have done an amazing job it's going to be so hard to pick the winner next week it really is um so if you want to join me 7 p.m gmt you know where it is the link is down below if you want to pop along and see me then i'm i'd be grateful I really would but if not i'll catch you now anyway let's stop rambling and get into game and stop building okay my darlings here we are with the pancake family now yeah, i've given them a bit more of a bumpkin makeover shall we say shush you're very loud i've gave them a bit of a bumpkin makeover because it needs to match in with the storyline that i've got going for them now we've got bob and eliza obviously they've both had a, they're both going through a bit of a midlife crisis they're both going they're I've made them adults as well, so they're a little bit older than what they are in the actual Sims 4 game. And this is their beautiful daughter, Lacey. We'll talk about that in a bit more. So Bob um, owns his own restaurant. We're going to be building Bob a restaurant as well for this save file. So Bob is going to have a restaurant that he runs. He's a culinary expert. Very, very good. He's going through a little bit of a midlife crisis with his clothes and stuff. He's been going to the gym, working out. He got his ears pierced as well. Um... Oh, he's fit, isn't he? <laughs> he's really hot. Trust me to make Bob pancakes hot. I mean, I had to do it. I really did. He's very, very beautiful. Now, him and Eliza, they are not getting along. And the main reasons being, they got together when they were in their, like, early 20s, married. And they've grown up now. They're in their late 30s. They're kind of finding out they're a lot different to each other. Um, they're both going their separate ways in their careers. I've actually made an, Eli uh, made an Eliza... I've made Eli Eliza a lawyer. She went to university later in life, I reckon, like sort of like early 30s. She went to uni, got a law degree, and now she's working her way up. She's actually late for work at the minute, but we're just going to. She's a budding barrister, my loves. She is, she is a budding barrister. Um, she's out of school now. She's working for a law firm. She's trying to get her own law firm. So she is working all the bloody time. And these two just do not see eye to eye anymore. Um, they really don't. They argue all the time. They're not happy in their marriage, but they're kind of staying in their marriage for their gorgeous daughter, Lacey, who I love. I love this character. Love, love, love Lacey Pancakes. Lacey Pancakes is gay. Lacey Pancakes is gay. She is out to her dad, so she's out to Bob, but she's not out to Eliza. She's trying to keep it secret from Eliza because she doesn't know how Eliza is going to react to the fact that she is a lesbian. And she, I reckon Eliza might find it a bit difficult because she... She's a twat. To be, to be honest with you, she's just a twat. And <laughs> it's going to be, it's going to be so, I've changed her traits and stuff as well, just to like sort of mirror in with the storyline. Um, let's have a little look. Um, or not Lacey. Lacey loves the outdoors. She's a vegetarian and she's, well, that comes with the collector trait. So she's got her two traits in a minute. Bob, I've changed his traits a little bit. I've kept his gloomy, his gloomy trait in there. Maybe the main reasons being he's just not happy. He's working all the time. He's trying to keep his restaurant afloat in these difficult times. And he's just not happy in his relationship with Eliza at the minute. As you can see, they're kind of like losing most of their friendship and their love life is not doing too good either. Because of his latest kind of 
interests with the gym and keeping active I've actually made him a bro and active as well just to kind of like go along go or go in line with that storyline and with Eliza I've made Eliza an insider because we're going to make this big group of all the other ladies like the desperate housewives so she loves being part of this group she absolutely loves it she's materialistic she's jealous but she's also business savvy as well which I'm just here for absolutely here for now with Lacey, I've actually made her friends as well with uh, Alexander, Cassandra and Leighton. Leighton is her best buddy. They are best mates. She is out to all of her friends as well. It's just Eliza who she doesn't really want to be out to just yet until she goes to university. And I reckon then she'll probably come out to Eliza properly. Bob is so supportive of his, of his daughter. Doesn't care who she loves. Um, and he thinks the same as well. Wait, make, maybe wait until you're out of the house before you mention it to Eliza Pancakes because once again she's a twat <laughs> but um I just love that I love this new dynamic that I've got for this family um what is that there oh <laughs> I had to give them a makeshift house just so they were living in this little house because I don't know why even though it's not real whenever I put a sim down on an empty lot and I leave them I'm like oh you've got nowhere to live so <laughs> to make them a house it was a bad house it really was look how many neighborhoods we've all oh, lots we've got going on here so loads of new families are coming to this place this place here i'm actually going to do two homes on this lot i think and have like a two separate families um living on the same lot together and just lock the doors do that kind of thing with them but obviously we're on this lot today this is the pancake residence so without further ado my darlings let's get into building and we're going to start creating the pancake house okay you beauties let's do this shall we let's change the name for a start we're going to do the pancakes my love oh the pancakers the pancakers i'm for that to be honest absolutely for it really am anyway hello i've missed you <laughs> really really have i hate not creating videos <laughs> i can't bear it absolutely can't bear not being able to create videos this is my happy place i'm in the career of my dreams um and when i can't create videos it makes it make me a sad sad man it really does i'm not for it who do I sound like? Robin Williams. You know when he's doing the um the characters for, for Mrs. Doubtfire? I think this might be a bit too much for the children. <laughs> Is that too wide? I think as soon as I get windows on there, it'd be fine. I'm gonna go for medium height walls, actually. I'm gonna go for medium height walls. Stunning. Obviously, this house is going to be up on some nice steep stairs. I would probably see this house being in like the San Fran area rather than um like New Orleans, but I like the vibe of it. So we're going to go for it. Not going to be too matchy matchy with the theme of New Orleans with this place. I mean, we ignore what I'm doing here as well. I'm just going to keep, do the box for the minute and we'll decide what else we're doing. We'll decide on what kind of shapes we're doing later. There we go. That's stunning. I'm for that. Really am. Let's put a little cheeky. Um, I'm not. Oh, yeah. No, we, 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 we will do a porch. Um, <laughs> for goodness sake, Aiden, get your shit together goodness sake right we've got that going on there it's gonna be quite a simple house would love to use custom content for this or i say that i say that every single time <laughs> oh i would love to use custom content for this but we can't because i don't we, we can't i don't want my save files one day i might do a save file with custom content in and might maybe stick to a, a few select creators but not for Willow Creek, loves. I want you guys on console to be able to download this and stuff, you know. I've got your backs, loves. I've got your backs, darlings. It's going to be all right. It really will. Let's have a look at you. Oh, you're very dominating. And I'm for it. I do like a bit of domination. <laughs> Already filth. And what are we? Ten minutes into the build? Disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. You should be ashamed of yourself. But you should also be very proud at the same time. Because you are sticking on brand. And that is the mantra for today the on brandness <laughs> it really is and um, a few of you guys have asked as well but the merch it's going to be a lengthy process i promise you that because i'm in talk well i've heard back from a merch company that i really want to work with because i've heard good stuff about them um and i'm waiting for another email and then it's got to be the designs i'm going to keep you all updated darlings i really am but i'm very excited for it should we do some blue stairs I did want to do a garage. Um, are you not going to be able to go there? It's because it's too bloody... It's too bloody close to the sidewalk. Pavement. 
not sidewalk well it is sidewalk we're in america aren't we in this playthrough so yes um can i pop these here blue that might change i'd love if there was some green do we want to do a three wide one i kind of do yes because it would fit the door in the middle rather delicious it really would do you know the perfect well it's not perfect but the best ones to use here for fence and all sorts is um where are you darling where are you there you are this one here in a white crisp white oh oh i'm feeling it really am they've got like kind of roman columns on this here i don't know if i'm gonna go for that but i might do i might do i bloody bloody well might do right and then these here as well unsure if we're keeping these stairs yet the stairs might change but i just like the color there for the minute now they have gone for a green siding but if i remember rightly the green siding in the sims is disgusting um no actually it's non-existent apart from this one. Oh, that's not too bad oh kind of like that can we change the lighting can we go for a bit more no no don't want to don't want to no no okay <laughs> okay maybe we'll stick with this one then instead i do like it it is rather delicious oh i think i'm for that you know yes yes i am now i don't know if i want to go for a stone foundation i'm just wondering if this foundation is a little bit too high i might just bring it down one more that's better that's better the balance is right i'm just looking at the reference it's going to be hard to match in windows but i think the perfect windows might be the snow escape ones um i might be able to double them up and have like this kind of moment here or I could just go... Oh, the only problem is... Let me just find something. I think the Strangerville. The Strangerville and the Crisp White. These were looking a little bit too big for me. But now that I've balanced them, I kind of like it. I do. I think I'm going to do that. The only problem that I'm going to foresee here is... Oh, hang on. You're not right. Oh. Oh, you little shit. Oh, well, you need to go across then. Just one there. Let me get you to there, darling. Any problem? I want access onto this balcony. And that's going to be difficult because these are bloody windows. So maybe I could just have, ac ac have access. I oh, know I want access here. I'm going to do a door. I'm going to do a door in the middle. Or maybe a door there. Like a white. Can I use that same door? In white, maybe? Do you come in a plain white? I just spat everywhere then. Oh, that's no... No, that's not the vibe. I do want a door there, though, to be honest. What about if I did the this one here in the middle in a plain white? Or I could do a pink. Like, in the mid... No. <laughs> oh, oh, no. I don't know. No. Absolutely not. No, it's just going to have to stick with windows. Oh, well. Never mind. Never mind indeed. I mean, I could extend it around the side or something and have like an axis. Of, but I don't want to do that. I really don't. So I'm not going to. I'm not. Not going to do it. I do like those windows with it though. I think they look very nice. So we're going to keep them in, I think. Why aren't you going on there, darling? Just there, look. That's all you had to do. It wasn't hard, was it? Was it? Was it? No. No is the answer to that. Oh, I kind of like that. Yes. Okay. Oh, the windows still look a little bit too big for me. One second. So I kept, I went through several windows. Oh, that W on the end of that pancake's there. No. And I kept the same ones. I've actually just widened the house one more tile. And I think that's balanced a lot better now in my eyes. And I'm for it. So I'm going to keep it. Yes, I am. So we're going to go in and put a nice trim on now. I'm wondering if I could do a bit more of like an ornate looking trim on this house. Oh, that looks good. Yes, that one there. Do you got the top as well? How about you look like at the top? Not too shabby. I don't mind that. Can I like bring these flaps down? Can I drag these flaps down one here? Hmm. I don't know actually. Now I'm looking at it. I don't think it will. No, it doesn't. Never mind. For a start, you need to be there, love. Yeah. Yeah, no, that's better. Yeah, kind of kind of there for that. Now, they have got Roman columns on this house, and I'm not sure if that vibe is going to be for this place. So let's test a few. I was thinking more along the lines of this. Can I, like, put a bit of pink in there as well? Oh, that does look good. Look. 
Yes, I think I might go for these, you know. Just to drag a bit more pink around. I want to make this a very fun looking house. We do. Um, you there. And can I get one in the middle? Of course you can't. Because fucking Sims, Aiden. Don't be daft. They won't allow you to put... Well, that column is kind of offset on this side. Oh, I can't. The Virgo in me is absolutely fuming with that. Now I'm just going to put a nice... I'm going to put a nice um, spandrel on instead. A nice ornate spandrel. Yes. Can I use you? Oh, that does look pretty. Yeah, yeah. So we're going to go for good, like a green, white and pink vibe for this house, I think. That will be smashing. That will be smashing. Will I be able to put one up here? No, because it's going to have to go there. Oh, that's making me very angry. I'm just going to pop you there. I'm just going to do you there, darling. Why not, you know? It's balanced in the middle now. They're just closer together in the middle. That's fine. Oh, that looks nice. I'm for it. I am. Right. And then I'm going to... What's that? Leaf capping? You what? <laughs> Is that what you're called? Leaf capping. Well, the more you know, darling, isn't it? Really? Oh, did I just get rid of that wall on the inside? I did. For goodness sake, Aiden. Get your shit together. Get your shit together. There we go. And then I'm going to get that detail back by popping each of these like this. Oh, stunning, stunning, stunning. And a bit there and a bit there. Oh, beautiful. Let me see you. Oh, you're looking gorgeous. Can you hear blue squawking away in the background? Well, snorting even, not squawking. Can I bring these down again? Just like to there? Yeah, that's better. Right onto the floor. Shall I do the same here as well? I think I should. That looks nice. Oh, it's very cute. Looking very, very cute at the minute. I I can't see the tile on the roof. I think I'm going to go for a brand new roof. So maybe like using these ones from... Oh, that's far too light. I mean, black would look nice. But I do... I want grey. But that grey was too... Too bright. Too bright for me eyes. It was. I mean, that's a nice new roof as well. But I do want to... I want it to look like this. I want this. I might use that one. Yeah, that's kind of cute. I'm kind of for that. You can imagine Eliza took over on the redecoration of this house. Bob wasn't about the green and pink, but just to keep the peace in the house so Eliza wouldn't go off in a pompous little mood like she would, you know. We all know Eliza. We really do. <laughs> um, and I want a window up here. Maybe using one of these up here, actually. Oh, that looks good. Can I get pink on you? Oh, I can look. Oh, I'm for it. I wish we had some detailed trims. Like, we all... I hate the Sims 4 trims. More things to hate from me. You're welcome. Um, <laughs> I'm just not a fan of the trims on the Sims 4. Um, and again, you're allowed to bitch about something that you love. You really are. Especially if it pisses you off somewhat, you know? Yeah, that's cute. Okay. So what I'm going to go and do now off of camera, I'm going to get a floor plan mapped out so you can kind of see where everything's going to be going and whatnot. And I'll be right back. OK, we've got a bit more of a floor plan going on. Ignore the overhang because we're doing a balcony and stuff there. So this is what happens into the main entrance here. This is a little bit too narrow here, but because of the window and stuff where the window placement is here, I can't really move this around and I don't want to awkwardly put a wall here or anything. So the Sims can still get through there. It's fine. Um, all the way back kitchen there's a toilet here downstairs toilet uh dining room and the main living area here which i have put a chimney breast in because we are going to put a nice little fireplace in here going upstairs it's got a big landing area here with access out onto this big balcony that i'm going to be doing up the back here a little ensuite bathroom for bob and eliza's bedroom which is this one and also this is going to be Lacey's bedroom here which has got a fireplace in it too and then the main family bathroom at the top there which is very nice i kind of like this I like the layout. We're going to put the windows and stuff on now. Um, this needs to be painted. I was thinking about maybe doing that brick or something. I don't know. Maybe not, actually. No, we'll just stick with the siding. We'll stick with the siding. Keep it simple, Aiden. Keep it simple and we'll do it this way as well. Lovely. And then I'll put a little roof on that as well. I think I'm just going to do uh, um, half gabled, I think. Let me just squeeze you out from there. Bring you down to that level there, love. Let me see that from this side. Yeah, I'm kind of here for that. Kind of here from that. And I will do the little green siding up there as well. And put the same roof as what we've got on top there. Oh, I'm kind of there for that. I really am. 
we'll get to detailing detailing all of the foundations in a bit i just want to get the main this is what happens with the first one isn't it it's just me getting the main footprint of the house down really do i want to come up one more there with a chimney no i'll just put a nice tall chimney on it instead and i think i might modernize the chimney so i might make it look more like this kind of vibe i wish this came in a bigger version of it as well i do love this chimney but i wish it came in a bigger version let me see is that glitch okay that's fine yeah, actually, I kind of like that. I'll put a half wall around that as well. And I'll actually brick this one here up. I don't know what brick we're going to use, but we're going to use something. Yes, we are. Yes, we are indeed. And I'll, I'll flop a little tiny little half wall around it. It just makes me feel better when I do this kind of shit. It really does. <laughs> really does. Yes. Now, what brick shall we use? Again, this has been modernized, but maybe the chimney could be the original brick. That's a thought in itself. Maybe I could go for something a bit more like this. Oh, that might like no, that might that might like <laughs> give up. <laughs> I'm not saying that. <laughs> Can't be bothered. It might like no. <laughs> it might look nice if you could say that. It might look nice and not very few. <laughs> fuming about that now do we have a matching brick with that i'm sure we do but it's got like a bloody line or like a trim on the bottom of it if i remember rightly um where are you i'm gonna find it we've gone for that one from get together because it might look, look, look nice it might look nice and it does i like it it's fun for it yeah it suits the build nicely i think but i want to do some wooden foundations some airy foundations down the bottom unless I could do like a solid one and put some vents on the foundation itself. Like I could use this. Do you come in a colour? You come in blue, but you don't come in... Oh, the pale blue looks nice. The lighting is really off here as well because of the position of this. I, I always forget. But I think that might look nice because I could put in some vents on it just to make it look like it's supposed to be there, if you know what I mean. Um, But I maybe want to put that siding on there. Oh, I don't know. I, I think we'll put siding on there, but I think I'll go for a more thicker white version. That's not white. Do you, do you don't want a white? No? No white for you then. Yes, like that. And then here what I'll do is put on some vents on the actual foundation itself. That, I'm going to have to do this with, with the um, tool mod. But I'll put a couple of vents just at the front. I'll keep them there so I won't remember, won't forget. And I'll pop them up on there with the tool mod. Just to make it look like it's air in the house from underneath. Oh, I'm for it. Yes. Yes, I'm for it. Okay, right. Let's start making this. I want a white picket fence around here. I think it's a very white picket fence household, this one. Um, I'm going to join it in with the paving slabs. And I'm going to use the same sidewalk sidewalk slabs here Let's go all the way along I'm, i want to go under there just so it makes me feel better there we go stunning yes and then obviously the white picket fence is this one here which i don't really use much really i don't really use this fence at all to be honest but i think it would suit this house i'm gonna do it um do i want a higher fence in the back what have we got going on yeah we've got a public pathway there so yeah we need a higher fence in the back so i'll skip you into there and then the same on this side as well. I don't think I'm going to do a gate per se. Nor I'm going to do um, a driveway. Or a, a, like a garage for this house. Even though the reference image does have a garage. It's connected at a different height. That wouldn't work with the Sims. Because Sims. Um, so what I'm going to do is move move some tool mod cars onto the street. For this particular street. I'm going to put some cars on the side of the road. So it looks like they're kind of parking up. Oh I'm for it. Yes, this is coming along rather nicely. I think what we'll do to kind of finish off is do the balcony areas um, and put the rest of the windows in as well. I think we'll do that. Yes, we will indeed. Do I want to make this a bit more longer in the front? No, I don't think I do. No, I do not. Arguing with myself once again. We need to remember this is a bedroom here. So I'm going to put them at that height, which is the same height, isn't it? Yes. One and two there in the bedroom. Let me see that. Oh, it's not balanced in the bedroom now. 
do want it to be kind of balanced in the bedroom. Even though asymmetry makes me moist. For this house, I'm, I'm feeling balanced. That's not balanced from the outside. And outside is more important. As far as I'm concerned. <laughs> so I'm going to do it there. there. Yes. And then down here, this is going to be... I might do one of the windows... Mm, maybe I could, can I move you? Nope, 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 can't do that. This is the kitchen, so I need to remember to put kind of like shorter windows in the kitchen area. The only problem is trying to match, oh, these would work well, actually. Oh, they've got the double ones, haven't they? So maybe we could do these, leave enough counter space down below. And then pop them, them there. Has that gone through a window there? It has. Oh, it has, which is making me fuming. <laughs> so instead of that, I'm going to make the... Oh, this is the kitchen anyway. I'm going to make the uh, dining room smaller, I think. <sighs> yeah, it's only four of them, you know. Or should I extend it out one? Let's come out one. Let's come out one more here. We'll come out one more. There's quite a nice big kitchen then as well. Let me see that. Let me just have a little look. Oh, I don't like them. Oh, I don't like them at all. And this being the dining room now, I don't really need to have smaller windows here. So I could put some bigger ones at the bottom there. Oh, I'm kind of for that a bit more. Yes, I am. And I am going to make this room a little bit bigger here as well then. Now that we've got the room, you know, you may as well. Do I want to do that? Do I want to do that? Yeah, I do. <laughs> yes, I do. Welcome to Fussy Fussy Aiden Day. It's a very Fussy Aiden Day today. I am going to make that bedroom, um, that bathroom the same uh, size, though, just because it's only an ensuite. It doesn't really matter. Nice big hallway, though. We're kind of, like, duped out on not having much space, though, here, have we? Um, it's quite a thin bedroom. So what if I did, like, that and that... Still gives me too wide there. And then that just gives me a bit more room to place anything that I could in the main master suite. Which I'm for. And I may... Nope, nope. Just shut up, Aiden. Just do what you're doing. For goodness sake. And then here, I'm going to come out one more there as well. Because we are going to now put the balconies on. Yes, we are. Yes. Yes, we are. Ladies, gentlemen, non-binary friends. Yes, we are. Indeed. Right. Build the ceiling on there, darling. Build the ceiling. Thank you very much. Um, the window balance at the back might be completely different here, only because of the rooms we've got going on here. Let's pull you all the way to there, my love. Oh, smashing. Smashing. Can we get you all the way around now? There we go. And on the middle as well, if you would. Don't want you on the breast. Keep away from my breast. <laughs> <laughs> why, why, why am I such a child? Oh, for goodness sake, Aiden. For goodness sake. Why are you here? I want you, I want you on here. What? Stop being a boob. Stop being a breast. Right there. Right, I, I, I fuck's sake just work just go on there i don't want you on the inside i want you there fuck you freezes and the hell that you crawled out from because i'm not for you right i'll do that off of camera because that's just wasting time we'll put a i'll, I'll figure out a way of putting a breast a breast <laughs> i'll figure out a way of putting a freeze up there i've got breasts on the mind friends really have and I shouldn't because I'm a gay. I do find them interesting though. Boobs are beautiful. They really are. They belong, they're all my favourite people. <laughs> oh, I'm such a child and I'm very much for it. I really am. Right. Oh, this is going to be the difficult bastard here. Oh, aren't you? You're going to be a bastard. I can feel you in my bones. Right. And then I was like, oh, we're not going to balance windows. That wall is right through that. So we'll figure out something there. And then we're going to do the same doors here. The doors in question, my friends. I think these ones here would look smashing. Do I want to do them pink? Yeah, I think we do. Stick with the theme, you know. And I'm going to do double doors at either end there. Oh, it's gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Now, the only thing I need to sort out is this here. 
but what I could do is maybe a little slopey slopey there a little cheeky cheeky there let me see this I mean the kit this is a big enough space for a kitchen quite easily oh god I'm just thinking that we need access here here and here um maybe it doesn't need to be slopey then maybe I could just do it like that that will give me enough space because I could put the entrance into the dining room there we've got obviously need an entrance here and we need a door on the toilet from the kitchen that's fine Yes, that's fine. Big enough dining room there, darling. Big enough dining room indeed. Oh, this is cute. Yeah, it's coming together nicely. It is. It's coming together. It's what I wanted for this house. And it's what we've got, you know. Do I want to, like, put the fence like there? But then it doesn't really give this much point here, does it? No. That does look good, though, doesn't it? Oh, <gasps> I know what I'll do. I'll put a bloody fence gate on it my love and then they've got access into it oh we've got the detail and we've got the access i'm for it i'm here and it's working and i'm there for it <sighs> all right darling can we change the direction of the gates well it lets us there we go just need to hold shift down for some reason oh i'm for that yes right more windows to the windows to the walls I don't know the rest of the words, so I'm not going to sing it and embarrass myself further. Um, okay. These. Right, where's the kitchen going? It's going over that side, isn't it? Do Oh, that might be good for space there, though. Too late. We'll put in a window there instead. <laughs> because this window would look delicious just above it. Oh. Oh, I was right. I was right, darlings. Don't necessarily need to put a window there because that's a stairway doesn't really matter or there to be honest with you because it's got a window at the front and that is a bathroom and all here because it is just a hallway maybe some smaller ones but then there's the difficult reasoning of trying to get in smaller windows because they just look weird they look weird here we're gonna try though let me see where this is where are you darling right if you can i wanted one by the side of it but what do you look like? Do you glitch out? Oh, you don't. You kind of don't. You know what? I'm not angry. I'm not angry with that. But I don't think we should do it downstairs. I mean, upstairs. I think we should just keep them downstairs, to be honest. Um, And I'll pop a couple of these windows. In fact, I'll do the double boys. Where's the doubles? Un double. I don't know what language that was I just said. But un double indeed. Oh. Oh, is this look? I don't want it to look McMansion-y. Like with oh, no, I don't like it. Oh, no, I'll figure out what to do there. Figure out what to do there. But for now, we've got a bare bones of something, haven't we? I might tart it up a bit for the thumbnail, put a tree here and there. Um, But it's looking cute. It's looking cute. Not much story to it yet, but we're going to make those stories come through, darling. Um, I think what I'll leave you on today actually is i'll finish off the rest of this balcony we'll finish off the rest of the balcony and that's done um can i put you up there no of course not i'll do that all around there why is this not working you can see that there's fucking flooring there darling why aren't you working why aren't you open tell us <laughs> why are you not why are you closed forever one of my favorite vines um, these aren't going to go to that height yet because... I'm sorry. Did I put you down there? No, I didn't. I need to get out the level we're working at. Um, right, there you go. Because of the freezes, this is all going to be a bit weird at the minute. Let me put these here. Now will you work? Oh, there you go. That wasn't so fucking hard, was it? <laughs> <laughs> Hmm, Jade. <laughs> there we are. Lovely. And a little cheeky staircase in the middle. No, I want to do it around the side. I'm going to do it around the side. And I'm going to copy this staircase. Because I am a filthy cheat. And I'm going to flop you there, darling, like that. Oh! oh, I don't like that siding. We'll change that. I don't like that siding on them. Oh, that's better, isn't it? And then a nice high fence all the way around. I'm going to choose this one because it's got the pale... The pale tone. And I'm going to stop you there, sweetie. And then whisk you all the way around, I am. Whisk you. All the way around, darling. 
like a cell all the way to this bit as well. And I'm going to get rid of that bit there too. And then we'll put some gates on these bits. I think little access points on either side. Oh, yeah, this is coming together, isn't it? Coming together. The pancake house is coming together. Need some details. I want some hanging plants. I want some outdoor ceiling fans. I need obviously need some flooring up here. I don't know what flooring to put up there yet, but we'll do that next time, my darlings. Yes, we will. There we bloody have it, my loves. The pancake residence is starting to take hold. It's starting to get a bit of personality. We'll do more tomorrow. Be back with this tomorrow. Um, and we'll stop making more changes to the exterior. Getting the garden done, I would imagine, tomorrow. It's quite a small house, two bedrooms, so it probably won't take us long. We'll probably finish it this week, to be honest with you. Hang, hang on. No, we won't. <laughs> We won't at all. We will finish this on Monday. Um, I'm I'm ahead of myself because I missed out on a day this week. But yes, done. The pancakes. We'll be back tomorrow with part two. Yes, we will. Um, <laughs> goodbye. <laughs>